Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you tonight for uh, another track review. Sorry that my face looks very red. I was just out in the sun today working and forgot to put sunscreen on and yeah. <laughs> but I'm returning to you for the new Weezer track review for their new song, I Need Some of That, that I just got done listening to. So I'm going to discuss what I listened to for this track and let you know my thoughts on it. So let's dive into this review. Now I hope you enjoyed my last two videos I made of, uh, well, that I made like this morning. I did the best I could to make them as good as possible. Uh, Rivers Como's vo vocals is, it feels cheesy, but at the same time, it's kind of likable. I don't know. I don't know what way to explain Weezer because they've had mixed good and bad songs. Um, Beginning of the End was a pretty good one. And the album is confirmed to come out May 7th. It finally is going to come out. So I'm like, finally. I'm like, finally we're getting a Weezer out, another Weezer album. This is going to be their 15th studio album. So I'm like, shit. I'm like, this is a lot. <laughs> uh, OK Human was... Eh, it was okay. I wouldn't say it was my favorite. There were some songs that I wasn't crazy about. Uh, that seemed very cheesy. But at the same time, I guess you could say uh, OK Human is an OK listen. It's not going to be on my best albums. That's not where it's going to be at. It's going to be in my OK to Meh albums. And I have high hopes for this new Van Weezer album, which it is going to be dedicated to Eddie Van Halen, who passed away back in October of last year. Uh, which, rest in peace to the legend, uh, Eddie Van Halen. He will be missed. Uh, he was a great guitarist. Uh, an excellent guitarist, I guess you could say. Um, but yeah, uh, this track wasn't so bad. Uh, there were moments where there was there was one lyric where he said, listening to Aerosmith and then calling my mom, and I'm like, where's this coming from? I'm like, uh, that's a little cringy of a lyric, but, uh they're known to make cringy lyrics from time to time, but at the end of the day, I think Weezer's, I thought I was going to be moving the laptop, but if I do, it's going to make a noise. At the end of the day, Weezer's new song is alright. Uh, not my favorite song, but it's something to keep us entertained before the new album drops. I'm sorry for my yawning. I know I do that a lot in my videos. <laughs> but for a score, I think I'm going to give uh, Weezer's new song, I Need Some of That, a 4.5 out of 5. Another solid track. Um, it just has some moments in the song where the lyrical content is not so great. But at the same time, it's likable. Uh, Weezer has these melodies where it becomes likable, and the album is going to consist of 10 tracks. The last song is going to be like almost 11 minutes, is what it's saying. But, uh, yeah, I hope it's a good album. We won't know till May 7th, so let's hope they pull it off with this rock album that they're going for because uh, they're known to make rockish slash pop mixture of genres they bundle up into uh, with their how they make their music and all that so the black album wasn't my favorite one and the last album was okay but I hope this one is a big success for them uh, comment below. Let me know what you guys thought of the 
new Weezer track, I Need Some of That, if you've heard it. And if you like this track review I made for you guys tonight, comment below and let me know your thoughts on it. Tap like on this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you can to support the channel. I will be returning to you for uh, another uh, video. I'm going to try to do it tonight. If I don't, it's because I went to sleep. And I feel like I want to go to sleep. <laughs> yeah, but still, I hope you enjoyed this track review or found something to enjoy about this track review. And how I was trying to explain what I listened to. And towards the end of the song, there was this weird cutout where it was just talking in the background. And something with copyright and... I was like, what? I guess this is like, it goes, leads into the next song, beginning of the end, which it is the next song after I need some of that. Because uh, it's track number four on the album. And I was impressed with this song. Uh, I'm not going to lie, it's not a bad song. Uh, not my favorite one, but... Weezer had some hits and misses with their Van Weezer singles. <sighs> Please forgive me on my yawning in this video. I know it's very bothersome for those that are watching uh, my video. But I hope you did find something to enjoy about this video except for my yawning. <laughs> um, and I'll return to you for a teaser trailer review for Shang-Chi and the... Legend of the Ten Rings, I believe I'm going to do a review on that Friday or Saturday. Uh, and tomorrow I will be doing Royal Blood's discography, starting it. And then I'll finish it on Saturday. And then move on to the next uh, discography for, I think I'm going to be doing Era Marathon Album Reviews. Uh, I'm going to give their albums a listen and see if they're very good. Because I really like ERA. They're a very good progressive metalcore band. But stay safe. Take care. Hope you enjoyed this review. And as always, I'll see you in my next video.